We say many thanks for taking this time watching this documentary. He's on a beautiful next musician, but without your support, we can't exist. We have the responsibility to help the next. Our children, our seeds, we have no future, we have no parents, some of them are orphans. But giving back and setting the first example to say that, hey, we love you, we miss you. Even though we're here in America, we haven't forgotten you. This is it. Launching here tonight, we're doing a future fashion show showing my designs. I'm stepping out to say I'm going to give back to my people and show them that I haven't forgotten about them. Without all the stuff I got from my Bay Area, I wouldn't be the designer that I am today. So giving back is definitely number one. Our season tomorrow, Radio Care with Majaro at .net. Let's get it together, people. Come on, make a change, step forward, make it happen. Hello, this is Bobby Michelle Crawford. I am here for, to talk to you about I will see you tomorrow, uh, a non-profit organization that was started by my cousin and brother, uh, Mr. D. Madonna Fulmer. I just want to talk to you briefly about uh, the essence of this organization. Uh, an English professor of mine once told me that the whole concept of education, whether it is in the institutional life or informal sense, entails the identification of human needs and of course the identification of uh, meaningful attainable goals and I have the conviction that this organization you know falls in that line you know there are a lot of things that is run over our educational system in Liberia and uh, I, I want to believe that a, a program of this nature organization of this nature will be able to bridge that gap so that we can have all of the stakeholders that have you know, vested interest in making sure that our educational institution is up to the 21st century. As you and I know that Liberia is lacking, both in our secondary and primary school system at our University of Higher Institution of Learning, you know, there's that gap. And I attended the University of Liberia, and many times we used to go in the laboratory. We never have most of the, uh, the test apparatus to be able to, to conduct a, a feasible experiment in our science lab. And I can go on and on explain the shortage of textbook material, instructional materials in different schools. See for tomorrow is an organization that can be able to liaise with stakeholders here abroad and elsewhere in Africa to bring about a workable plan of action that can help, you know, be able to, you know, strengthen education in our country. Hey, my name is Makupa Chanda. I am from Zambia. I came to America, graduated with a Bachelor's of Science in Ed Economics from Kansas State University. I'm here to talk about Our Seeds Tomorrow, which is a nonprofit organization and basically just how growing seeds, which would be growing our future generation of tomorrow, the young children of today, with, through education, which is a strong value I hold dear to heart. Having had come back from, having had been raised in a family that emphasizes on education and seeing how it can work wonders in shaping a person's future and having them be the person that they ideally want to be giving young children of today an opportunity to have endless you know, opportunity to sow or grow in the world today, but starting with the foundation that is growing from Liberia, our seeds tomorrow. We ask that you may donate, be of service, and help with this movement so we can create future leaders of tomorrow. Our seeds tomorrow is a foundation that is building future propagation for the next generation. We're building a sustainable foundation to allow our youth to manage their instability in all expected challenges. The greatest wealth that can be given to an individual is an education. 
an education that will allow individuals to cultivate their greatest attributes. As we all know, education is the roadmap to success. Our goal is to develop an advocacy organization dedicated to building schools. Our goal is to develop an advocacy organization dedicated to building schools. Our mission, commitment, and hope is based on educating the next generation in Liberia, Haiti, Zambia, Congo, Jamaica, Jamaica. Look into their eyes. I see greatness. I see our next generation tomorrow. Our seeds tomorrow. Our seeds tomorrow. Oh, just get along. Our seeds tomorrow. Let our seeds. Let our seeds. I give them all the future. Give them a smile.
Our goal is to develop an advocacy organization dedicated to building schools in Liberia. We have had a demographic change in Liberia. In Moravia, as you can see, it is where the beacon of hope seems to exist, more than other parts of the country. So everybody has migrated. Most people in the country has migrated to the capital city. Now we have a high population in Moravia. And we have schools that has been built by our organization, church, like the Lutheran Church, the Baptist Church, the Episcopal Church, the Catholic Church, and all the non denomination continuously, seven days of vanish. All has built schools across Liberia. But we have a population growth since the Civil War. People migrating back home for a better life in Moravia. But we have less schools than we had before, back in the 80s, 70s, and 90s, because of this prolonged Civil War 14 years. I ask each and every one of you around the world to please join this movement, be part of this conversation. We have a national crisis. We must dedicate our time in planting a seed for harvest for a better tomorrow. Our people need us, Liberians. Let's get back to work. As Dr. Warren Narutawa said, in order for Liberia to become a big bear basket, in order for Liberia to become self-sufficient, in order for Liberia to have a global presence, we must build our foundation by planting seeds through education and giving opportunities to the youth that they will be able to manage their instability and all unexpected challenge in life. That they may be able to manage their own affair and that they will also may come and return back to the same societies that have given them the opportunity of life to be part of that same society by contributing to society, to be a service to society and also uplift the brothers and sisters. The Our Seeds Tomorrow Project is our future tomorrow. Our leaders tomorrow, our presidents tomorrow, all the greatest foundation of our country tomorrow. My name is Daze Fuma, founder of the Our Seeds Tomorrow Foundation. Well, our Seeds Tomorrow that all. Look into their eyes. I see greatness. I see our next generation tomorrow. Our Seeds Tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Our seeds tomorrow.